Good afternoon. I'm Erica Sargent. Great to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlin. We begin with new details in the Delphi, Indiana murder case. Richard Allen now officially charged in the 2017 murders of two teenage best friends, Abby Williams and Libby German. This case shook the small community of less than 3,000. Our Tara Molina is in Delphi at the Bridge Trail where the girls were last seen. The trail where the girls were hanging out back in February of 2017, just about a mile from where we're joining you right now, is a memorial again today. Their community of Delphi reminding the world today is about them, Abby and Libby. Two lives taken by a man police say they've charged five and a half years later. It's always not settled well with me, the fact that whoever's responsible for this has been walking around now for five and a half years as a free person. And that's not right. That's Libby German's grandfather, Michael Patty, on murder charges in his granddaughter's case. Charges against a man who never left. 50-year-old Richard Allen is in jail, being held without bail, pleading not guilty. Patty hopes anyone with information chooses to speak up now. Because there's people out there who probably now can relate, <clears throat> you know, maybe know this guy and have a bit of information that, that could help. We've learned Richard Allen is a Delphi resident and worked at this CVS on West Main Street. Photos pulled from social media accounts since taken down show Allen and his wife out and about since the 2017 murders. But this photo, the most important piece of evidence shared with the public to date, a picture from a video taken by Libby German during what police have only called criminal activity. State police calling this man the person behind their deaths. So is the man in the photo Richard Allen? What led up to charging him? Could there be another person involved? Police aren't saying a word. Here's the photo next to Allen's mugshot, the first sketch released, and the latest. Richard Allen isn't set to face a judge again until January. Again, he pleaded not guilty in his first court appearance. Police want to remind you this is still an active investigation and they're still looking for tips. We have more information on how you can submit them in this story on our website right now. Reporting in Delphi, Indiana, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News. As Tara mentioned, there's a lot of information police are not yet releasing. Key documents in the case are sealed. There will be a public hearing on whether those records will be released soon. You can read more about the suspect. Meantime, Richard Allen's life in the small Indiana town of Delphi. That's on our website, cbschicago.com.